What is up, guys? Chicken356 here, bringing you Life Strange Episode 1 Part 3. Uh, I did get a new TV, it's HD, so my videos are gonna look a lot better now. But yeah, so here we go. We're right where we left off, leaving the classroom I hope I for the second time. time. To get to the bathroom. Please, please, I can't tell anybody. Don't Whoa. Think crazy. Dun 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 dun. Okay, Max, retrace every step. Turn it down a little. I washed my face. Oh, you looked in the mirror first. I shredded my photo. Then the butterfly flew in. Yes, and then there it is again. You forgot the Illuminati part, too. What in the world? What? Oh. Hold on. Sorry. Sorry. Come on, put that thing down. Tell me what to do. Wowzer, it's happening again. I need a hammer to break it open. Hell, a more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Darn it. Oh, holy shit, I can't let this happen. If I can reverse time again, I can help her. Trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! I need God. a hammer to break it open. There we go. Sick of people trying to control me! Get in hell more trouble Wait, where's the hammer? Drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? There we go. You go, girl. Another shitty day. Hey. <laughs> Poop. Poop putt. Happen. Oh, Illuminati. <laughs> he said he said that because we're in a bathroom, you know. What the fuck is going on? So freak out. There's optional photos and I'm trying to I'm just looking around at what I could take. You know? Okay, let's go. That's really annoying. It's really annoying, excuse me. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? Yeah, I do. It means you should be outside. Well, I guess what? I'm not. Girls always use that excuse. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in heels. And yours is covered in dead squirrel. Oh, that's a mustache? Oh, sorry. Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. Oh, yeah, not to harass little girls. <laughs> or teenage girls. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Principal. I'm just gonna run over here. Run! You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? Uh, no. I'm just a little worried about my future. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You can always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. You're not giving me enough time to talk to you. We're oh. We're gonna hide the truth, and then we're gonna teleport back in time, just got and then class. report them. Oh. Except you're wandering around like a zombie. And do you think that's the first time a student has used that line on me? It's the truth. I felt dizzy in Mr. Jefferson's Just class. tell me what you're hiding. You can trust me. There's nothing to hide. I got sick. It happens, you know. There's that team toot again. You know, I've, I've heard enough. Don't think I don't know what's going on around here. You've only been here for three oh, weeks, and sorry. you're already causing conflict. I don't think your what? parents will approve when they find out. Now get outside with class. Please. You know what? Or I could just no, reverse I time. I may have just flushed my scholarship down the toilet. Yes, I could have on actually telling the truth. You look a little... There we go. I just saw Nathan Prescott waving a gun around. In the girls' room. Nathan Prescott. Yeah. You sure? 
Yes. yes. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw That's everything. That. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. And then you watch the world get shot a couple times. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girl's room. I know, I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. <laughs> Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family. And one of Blackwell's most honored students. Well, he so shouldn't be that honored. Him brandishing a weapon in the girl's bathroom. So what happened next? Then, then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you going to bust him? This is a serious charge. I'll look into the matter first. Uh huh. That's what they all say. That's it? After what I told you? We'll continue this discussion later in my office. Please go outside with the rest of your class down this coffee. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Of course this academic drone won't do anything since the Prescott family owns Blackwell now. Do I go out here? Should I rewind and change my story? No, you shouldn't. After this series, we'll probably go back and do some of the things that we didn't do. Maybe. Uh, outdoors. Blackwell Academy is a messed up place to be. You probably shouldn't go here. Oh, Nathan's in trouble. She looks so hopeful and pretty. I wonder what happened to her. Uh, she went missing. Okay. So, we're gonna start running. Whoa. Sorry, running late and same day. I'll meet you in the lot looking cool. You'll see. My camera will be ready to see you shortly. I hope so. Okay, so this guy. Warren. Okay, I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. Okay. Is it this way? Whoa! Look at that drone. Go to the... Okay. Let's go. Yeah! Actually, you know what? I'm gonna end it here. Uh, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Be sure to subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.